Hello, in this video I would like to show how to create a new Inno Setup installer from scratch using Microsoft Visual Studio and Visual and Installer. Visual and Installer is um, Visual Studio extension for creating NSIS and Inno Setup installers. Uh, so start with creating new project. Simply click new project on start page or choose file new project. Select the Inno Setup project template and fill project location and project name. OK. The new project has been created. You can see the script file. In the Solution Explorer, you can see the solution files. And also you can view them in uh, Windows Explorer. This is script file, solution, user options file, solution file, and the Inno Setup project file. The output folder is folder when the resulting installer will be placed. Uh, let's now compile this uh, script. We need to set the installer name. which is the same as the project. Save everything and hit this um, green arrow or F5. And here we go. This is our new installer. As you can see, the installer is really simple. It contains only a few pages which are pretty standard. The basic features of Visual and Installer are syntax highlighting, which makes the script colored, go to feature or navigation bar, which allows you to quickly jump into various sections in script file and the compilation itself. The log of compilation can be viewed in the output window. If you made any mistake in the script file, you can see the errors or warnings in the error list window. Double click to jump to the error. Let's create simple hello world uh, message when the installer starts. Uh, this requires new section code and uh, Initialize the wizard procedure. Create new uh, variable and show this um, as message box text. You can use uh, IntelliSense code completion here. Simply write few uh, characters and hit control space and all possible items are shown so you can choose from them. And as you can see there are many many useful functions, procedures uh,
and other items. So let's assign some text. Now you can compile the installer again. Hello world. As you can see, the scripting is really easy. It's these uh, features provided in Visual Installer. If you made any mistake, you got error. Okay. These are basic features of Visual Installer. Thanks for watching.